Hi everyone, hope you are doing well from wherever you are watching this channel, depending on your time zone. Now, when William Ruto was leading the Jamhuri Day celebrations in this country, some Kenyans were also leading protests against <laughs> William Samway Ruto. It is clearly showing that Ruto has become our biggest problem, whereby when you try to explain to Kenyans what you have done and what you intend, you intend to do, Kenyans find no any sense in whatever you are telling them. Instead, what they see is all about rejecting William Ruto. So, there is one man all the way from Kiricho who has been so much consistent on rejection of William Samway Ruto, who came out to demonstrate his protest against what Ruto is doing in this country, governance, handing now all our natural resources to outsiders, and how he's messing this country. His warning is that Ruto should prepare. The same way he used to uh, use the wheelbarrow to beg for the vote, in the same way they are going to drive him home on wheelbarrow, direct to Sugoi, ahead of the next election. That means Ruto has failed the Kalenjin. He has failed the people of Rift Valley. He has failed the Kenyans at large. And therefore, the only thing that they can serve William Ruto, it is rejection and sending him home direct. So when he was leading celebrations, Kenyans were leading protest against him. Nikiwa ndani ya kericho rais wa nchi William Ruto umesindwa na uongozi hapa Kenya mpaka umesika mstuni umeusi ya wazungu sasa wazungu watakuja kuisi na kujenga manyumba na umesika Kenya kama keja hako unakuja unalala kidogo keso unaenda inji sa inji na rais 2027 isi mawilbaro nyuliomba na ayo kura ndiyo sita kupereka nyumbani ma escort ndiyo isi siko nyuma now we are continuing this panel discussion, but just a quick request. For those who are watching and you have not subscribed, please consider subscribing. To our channel subscribers, I must say thank you so much. And again, to all our viewers, please give this video a thumbs up. Thank you so much and back to this discussion. So the message is short and clear. Ruto, you have failed to govern this country. We are selling our forest and as our water jenga, but indeed it's all about the carbon credit business. The problem is that in as much as they are engaging in this business, as a dumping it up, it's talking about Mao Forest. This regime will never explain to us what they will use this money. And it's huge money. One of our viewers was more knowledge on that explained a lot to me. And this is a booming business. The world is targeting Africa. And Ruto is quick to do this multi trillion business. But the problem is that Hawata White Wambia, he your pesa imefanya nini? What a jenga really? Barabara. Mashule, hospitali, ama nini. Nakini they are providing a dumping site here. Talk about Ruto, globetrotting. Indeed, Ruto has become an international tanga tanga. He took tanga tanga ring to international level. When he was the deputy president, the tanga tanga ring was nationally and then locally. He never sit down in office to work for Kenyans. But with that alone, it was enough for Kenyans to understand how do you vote for someone who never sit down to work instead is on rooftop, sunroof of his vehicle in campaign mode. You can't govern on top of your vehicle. You can't govern when you don't sit down to listen to advice and take instructions in governance.
So the behavior of William Ruto did not change. He just improved it and took it to international level. That is the truth. So, this one is about, about a rider. A man who was among the peoples that Ruto had targeted to woo and win their support because he told us that he is going to make the government of Mamamboga, Boda Boda and Hasala. So, he is here to represent the Boda Boda riders. People who are building this economy. Not just sector ya Boda Boda, na taxi, na matatu, ndiyo ina build hike na pakubwa. He is leading rejection of William Samoy Ruto on Jamhuri Day celebration. According to him, Ruto is not worth to lead. And the only thing remaining is to take this man to Sugoi. So he has used these wheelbarrows that he came to them with to warn him that they would use the same wheelbarrow to carry him to Sugoi. That means it's going to be disasters. It's going to be one of the worst being driven on a wheelbarrow. It's a total rejection. So Ruto should know that his protest, if there is anyone planning protest, then it is his own people from Rift Valley who are going to lead a Ruto must go protest. It is Kalenjin who are leading a Ruto must go mass action. They are the one who are popularizing for William Ruto must go. They are the one leading a rejection of one of their own. Kama hawa jamaa wanakataa mtu yao. Wewe unatoka Mount Kenya unasema Ruto is a good president. Kichwa yako iko sawa. Ama uko na ulemavu wa mawazo. Unatoka huko Western unasema Ruto is a good president. When Kalenjin themselves are saying that this man must go and he will go on a wheelbarrow. Unatoka hapo unasema Ruto ni mzuri. Utakuwa kuna kichwa mzuri. Unatoka Nyanza region and they are telling us that Ruto is the best president. When his own people are seeing a problem in his leadership, then you are sick. Unatoka Lower Eastern Coast, Nairobi, elsewhere. When he has been rejected at home, that means he has failed to offer leadership from home. So how can you lead outside here? He was a can. So Ruto, if he's sitting pretty in state house thinking that he has second term, I heard Gashago telling Kenya that give William Ruto 10 years to build the economy. That was a total failure telling us that in the next five years, Ruto is not going to work for you because he's planning on how to work. According to Gashagwa, five years is years for planning. Another five is another is the second term to execute that plan that we have been doing for five years. Now the message is here for Gashagwa, Ruto and his allies. 2027. Itakuwa ni In fact, this man is fair. These people will not finish their ten, their five years in office. And if at all they will, then they will have no peace. It will be five years of protest, rejection in state house. They will never enjoy. However, if Bakura went up a state house and you think that you will sit pretty and enjoy governing this country, you can't enjoy they were clueless. They have proved to us that they can't lead. They have failed to show leadership. So you cannot lead us. Kitu ya wizi, ayeni bali. Pia kitu ya huku jipangia, you don't see the, you know, if you do not put any much input on something to get, you just got it by favor. But not this favor from God, from human beings who want to go against the law, who want to change Kenyans, you cannot enjoy. So, Ruto will never enjoy his five years. He will never enjoy. Rejection is all over. 
and there's a lesson to learn. People have discovered that you cannot lead a protest to tell William Ruto to work. Today, the only protest is all about a Ruto must go. Not that Serikali idea here, Serikali fanya kazi, wamejua hata fanya kazi. So you cannot protest to tell Ruto to work. You can only say that Ruto, you have to go. So the language that Kalenjins are adapting is a Ruto must go. Everyone has suffered and about the border riders are discovering that, doing that this man just duped them. He lied to them and he has every bad plan against them. Nothing good and the, the, protest, is, the protest is all over. <laughs> Kama Ruto hana habari, bas watu wake wa mfikishia habari ya kwamba watu wa eh, watu wa Rift Valley Watu wa kiricho wana mkataa. 